Hey guys, Dan Heilman, back with another Eternal Evolution video. Uh, I'm going to go through and I'm going to collect all my rewards from the altar, and I'm going to kind of go through all of my altar gear on my free-to-play account, this account right here you're looking at, um, and I'm just going to talk about what I'm saving, what I'm locking, what I'm getting rid of, what I'm smelting into other gear. Uh, the whole goal of this is I'm going to try to get some better... Um, healing gear on Serena and my Liran. So I'll also kind of be building some heroes. So if you're interested in that, enjoy the video. All right, my favorite part of Monday is you wake up and you come in here and you go into the ancient altar and you hit the collect button and you're just like, woo, let's go. Here's the free to play account. We got that, we got that, we got that. What do we get here? Oh, it doesn't let me look at them all, okay. That's more red gear. Got some more white gear. Ooh, nice. 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 Okay, there's the free to play. Let's go to the main account. Ancient altar. Collect. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, we even got 60 of those. Oh, man. We got some good stuff in here, hopefully. Crit rate. Damn it, defense. We just need attack gloves. We just need attack gloves. Okay, okay. Oh, it's still coming. Yes, yes. Ah, oh, defense again. Damn it. Damn it. Ooh, HP with defense on abundant. Ooh, that's a good piece. All right, what else we got in here? Um, okay, all right. I don't think any of the, um, oh, I have some achievements to grab. Oh yeah, got some achievements in here as well. Oh, we got some red exclusives. Oh, I forgot to check for achievements on the other account. Um, how do we get into D so what happened here? Uh, challenge. Ooh, we got some achievements here as well. Beautiful. Ooh, we got a couple of pieces of white gear. Ooh, four of them. I like it. I like it. All right, we're going to go through some gear real quick. Just for fun for the video. Um, what did we get here? Ooh, eight of them. I'll show you kind of what I'm keeping for these special sets. I guess that'd be kind of fun for the video. Let's... Uh, all right, we're on the free to play. We're gonna just click anyone. We're gonna go to equipment. We're going to uh, hit replace. We're gonna just go through all these sets real quick. Go gluttony. Um, defense main set on gluttony is gonna be used on artists, most likely. Um, so that one definitely works. Oh, that one's already locked. I already locked that one. Okay, crit damage reduction, I'll keep that. Attack on a gluttony. We'll keep that. Oh, it's already locked. <laughs> um, another attack. Okay, that's fine. Another one that's going to be used for probably artists. Attack that's locked. Defense that's locked. Attack that's locked. Okay. Um. Yep, I already locked that one. Yep, already locked that one. Okay, you can see what I'm doing here. I'm just really caring about the main stats. Here we go. Wow, they gave me so many pants. Okay, this one will definitely be used probably on Emma. That one's already locked, okay. I must have already had that one. Defense, damage reduction, crit damage. Actually, that's decent on Artis. Okay, that one's already locked as well. Um, damage reduction, crit rate. That one uh, is definitely going to be decent. This one's going to be decent. Damage reduction, crit damage reduction, HP. So this uh, can also be like on an Artis would be useful. Um, this one's pretty bad. We'll leave that unlocked. Crit damage, defense damage reduction. This one's actually pretty solid. That one's already locked. Okay. Let's see what I'm doing here. Um, don't care really too much about these because I have I have good white ones, so I don't care too much about the red ones. Damage reduction, crit rate. Okay. Gluttonous attack. Ooh. That one's good for Emma. We got attack, HP. Perfect. Oh, I'm going to try to get Emma in a gluttonous set real soon, especially on my main account. This is the free-to-play again, so that's good there. Let's check weapons, see if there's anything we want to lock here. Defense damage reduction again, that's going to be good for artists. Crit rate, crit damage, okay. That 
can be useful. HP, defense, damage reduction. This is like perfect for artists. You want HP, you want defense, you want damage reduction, and then you want probably a little bit of crit and crit damage, um, or maybe just really high defense. I'm not quite sure for artists yet for building the gluttony set. Um, we'll keep that because it's attacked. Don't I have an attack base already though? Ooh, I do. Okay, I have this one with attack, damage reduction. Okay. So I don't care too much about these. We'll just look real quick. Um, Okay, so that's Gluttony set. Boom. Now I'll show you what I keep for Abundance set. Um, okay. Mm, attack crit rate. Uh, This one's good. We got HP percent. I'm really looking for HP percent on Abundant. That's going to be my, my favorite stat there. Now, whenever you're like this and you have an open slot, always roll this up to four first. Like if I go here and you can see what I did there. So one, two, three, four, crit damage. Okay. So if that would have rolled HP percent, that would have made it even better than the other piece, right? Because then I'd have HP and defense. For this one, we can roll it and um, see what we get on the last piece. Last stat, I mean. Crit rate, okay. So we got damage stats on the healing set, of course. Um, I'll probably keep this one just because of the damage reduction. Defense percent. Ah. Ah, eight attack percent. That sucks. So these, I just don't know where you'd ever use them, right? I don't know where you'd ever use them. You really want the HP percent because most of the healers scale their healing off HP. So I don't know if I'm going to keep either of those, honestly. Um, attack, HP, damage reduction. Okay, so that's fine. Damage reduction on the healing set. Flat, HP, meh. Because I have this one, okay? So that's going to be more useful. Another HP one. Okay, I'll make sure to lock those. Okay, good. All right, so that's abundant. Now we're going to go through isolated. No, not isolated. What's the other? We can go through light gap real quick, actually. Uh, HP is going to be good. HP is going to be good. Defense. Possibly. Possibly. Oh, man, the defense reduction one is here, unfortunately, or damage reduction. Uh, here, I'm looking for probably just. HP. There we go. That works. We'll keep that one. Uh, this set I probably would use on res. I don't know who else I would use this set on, um, but I'm really looking for HP yet again. HP and damage reduction. It's kind of the same for all of these. Uh, besides gluttony, obviously, you're looking for attack or defense. So it has one roll of HP percent. I'll roll another and we'll see what we get. Damage reduction. Okay, so HP and damage reduction, that's like perfect. This is a good piece. We got HP, we got damage reduction, and crit damage reduction, actually. So that's useful for PvP. So we got all tanky stats here. Good to go on that one. Here's another one with HP percent. Um, These are pretty bad. This one potentially could have another HP percent, so I'll keep that. And then I'll probably just use the, um, the smelting feature to get rid of the other two and try to get a, a different set there, right? This one, don't care about. Okay, and then the last set I'm gonna go through is going to be um, Herald, okay? What do we got here? I'm looking for HP percent on Herald. That's really what I care about because it's increasing shield strength. Shield strength scales with HP as well. So clearly I'm gonna want both of those. Damage reduction. Um, what I'll do is I'll just roll this up to four. And then if it's not good, if I don't roll HP percent, Damage reduction. Mm. Uh, I'll probably still get rid of that one. Don't care too much about a Herald set. I'm only going to put it on Hercules, so I don't really care that much about it, right? So again, we got, this one's probably the best one. It's got flat HP, I guess. So if this rolls HP percent, I'll keep it. If it doesn't, I won't. Crit damage. Okay, so I don't care about that piece anymore. Let's roll this one up to four as well. And this is what I'm going to do every time. And then everything that I have unlocked, I'm just going to feel free to use it in the smelter, re-roll it for new gear, etc. Um, yeah. 
Okay, we got defense. I'll keep that one. I'll, I don't feel like rolling it up right now, so I'll just leave it there. I'll keep that one because it has damage reduction. Um, and then the rest I have pretty bad stats, so I don't care. Defense, percent, don't care. I already have one of these in HP, so I really don't care about crit damage reduction on this set. Um, no, uh, Nothing else I care about, so that's that. Flat defense, don't care. HP, okay, I'll lock that. Um, I have my filter set to automatically feed the red um, pieces of gear, so I do try to come in here first and lock them. Although I just realized I was rolling some up to point four, so I might got rid of some, but honestly, it doesn't matter too much. Um, I'm not really using red gear that much on my account, so that's that. Okay, that's going to be it for the video. I kind of just wanted to go through gear, um, go through those four sets, kind of show you what I'm keeping in those four sets. Um, and then I just literally, I go in after, now that I've done that, I go into my bag, again, I use the smelt feature again, I talk about the smelt feature again, um, but the reason is, is it's just so good for getting these sets, right? So if I want a healing set or a gluttony set, that's what I'm doing. Um, I'm just getting rid of everything that I, I don't have locked now. Um, I actually, this is my free to play account, so I need to check my Serena. I might, I think priority is always healing sets on Serena. Yeah, so I should probably be trying to get a couple healing sets here, huh? So I have a healing set here. Um, Abundant. These were all the attack and defense. Yeah, okay. Here I don't have anything useful. Okay. Here I... Oh, man. So I do kind of want a healing set. Okay, so I do want a healing set. I don't have a perfect healing set for her. These are all actually quite bad. Um, so yeah, we actually want to prioritize crafting healing sets, and then I'll work on gluttony. Gluttony is kind of like an end game. You can put your Emma in there, um, and possibly Ardis, and get a little bit more damage out of them. But in the beginning, the really thing that the big thing that's going to help you is just this healing set, right? So now I have healing set selected. I can get rid of some of the stuff I don't care about. Um, like this piece I don't care about. This piece with three sets of flat stats I definitely don't care about. Flat defense, don't care about. Um, I might, might, maybe use that one. Definitely not going to use an attack one. Definitely don't care about crit damage reduction. There's my five. We're going to hit smelt. Oh, if that was HP percent. We were sitting pretty. All right, so now I can literally just put that right back in because I'm not going to use crit damage <laughs> on a healing set. Um, this one has terrible stats. This one has even worse stats. This one has terrible stats. Terrible stats. Okay, so now we get another healing set. Ooh, and we win the game! Wow! HP percent on the abundant. That's exactly what I was looking for for Serena. That's actually the exact slot I wanted to. I'm going to get so many comments below <laughs> saying, Dan, you're so lucky. I don't get shit from the smelter. But look at that. Now I just replaced my red piece of healing gear with my beautiful abundant piece that I just pulled right here. We're just going to forge that guy right up into oblivion. We're going to go straight. Because I care more about the set and more about the main stat. So I don't really care that I rolled attack crit rate. Let's just hope for something like defense. And we got attack. We got uh, crit damage reduction. Okay. Don't care. Look at how much HP I just gained, right? So I did lose 4% damage reduction. But I gained a lot. So you can see my HP was 960k. We're going to put this on, and now my HP is 1 million. 1 million. Uh, it doesn't seem like a lot of HP, but it all helps. Um, definitely all helps. And I can actually probably upgrade some of these now. Here's the HP percent. Um, this one has damage reduction. So I'm going to roll this one up a little bit because it has damage reduction and defense. So if I roll HP percent, this is the one I want. No, I rolled crit damage. Okay. So then I ignore that one. We're going to go over to this other one here that had HP percent. Yep, this one right here. I'm going to roll this one up. Oops, I went to five. That's okay. Defense. Okay, so this is the one I want. It's got HP and defense on it. Um, so we're like, sweet. Let's uh, just roll this up and hopefully it rolls good. HP and defense. How do you like that? Wow, I'm a lucky boy today. All right, so that's going to replace that. It's looking really good. Um, I 
unfortunately don't have a good piece here. This one actually is not terrible, so we'll just leave it. Um, let's see what we got going on here. We do have, uh, the one I have is pretty awful. Um, we'll lock it and we'll probably use it somewhere, but there's gotta be something better here. Um, we have this one that has HP. We have this one that has HP. Let's roll this one up just a little bit more. See if we can get some HP rolls. We got flat HP. We'll roll it up to 12. We got crit rate. Okay, so we didn't, we missed the HP percent. We're going to go here. We're going to forge. We're going to go to 12. If I get HP percent, no, I got accuracy. So that one's probably even worse. Um, probably roll this one and we'll just take it to 16 and hopefully get an HP percent. We got crit. That sucks. Okay, I might actually just roll this one up to 16 as well. Um, Dude, you can't give me one HP percent roll. Okay, so let's see what we got here. We got this. Um, I think we take this one. Because it has a little bit more HP. Yeah, I think we take this one. It's just going to give me a little bit more HP. Uh, I lose a tiny bit of crit damage reduction, but I don't care that much. Um, so yeah, that's the new gear we got on Serena. Pretty sweet. This piece has ended up being pretty nice. Obviously the substats suck, but in the beginning, you want to focus on your sets first, then your main stat, and then once you have multiple of those, you can actually pick one with better substats and get upgrades that way. But in the beginning, you just want the set and you want the main stat. Roll it up to 16 right away. Don't forget you don't lose XP in this game ever. You can always just use the smelter or just feed it to another piece. Boom. That's it for the video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Just wanted to go through my gear from Ancient Altar, show you what I'm keeping, what I'm not, what I'm re-rolling, etc. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If that's going to be it for the video today. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, hit the like and sub. Baby Lucas says, hey guys, hit that like and sub. Woo! All right. Have a great day, everyone. See you guys.